Van Dooling Basics, How to Live in a Van on Any Budget, a book by Chris Ahn, edited by Jennifer Karchmer. Who is this book for? This book for anyone who glances at a van or RV and sees opportunity. Maybe you see the opportunity for adventure. Maybe it's your chance to finally to leave the rat race. Or maybe you just want to save some money. No matter what your end goal is, You'll make the most out of this book and your van dwelling journey by viewing living in the van as a positive opportunity as opposed to a pitiful existence. And what if you don't see opportunity? What if you look at a van or RV and think, Ick, I could never live in that? Well, you're probably right. I don't think you'd be happy, at least not with that mindset. The people who are happy living in vans are the people who want to be living in vans. They're people who choose to live outside the box, literally. It's important to maintain a positive attitude because the honest truth is that living in a van isn't always easy. It can be uncomfortable and cramped. Things will go wrong. For example, you might head off on your adventure only to get stuck in the mud. Or maybe you'll hear a strange noise in the middle of the night and find yourself driving around at 3.30 a.m. looking for a different sleeping spot. If you don't maintain a positive attitude and view these inconveniences as part of the adventure, you won't enjoy the lifestyle. But I suspect that since you've already read this far, you probably don't need much more convincing. Now you're probably wondering, how could I possibly pull this off? It may be of some comfort to know that I had the exact same question prior to building my camper van. Now that I've built my cozy little home on wheels and put the van dwelling lifestyle to the test, I can offer these words of encouragement. It's not as hard as you might think, and you can do it. Every new challenge has a solution, usually multiple solutions. And that's what we'll talk about in this book. We'll consider different ways to shower on the road, cook, stay warm, and much more. Some ideas might strike you as awesome, and others might seem terrible. Every van dweller has a different set of preferences, so we'll cover everything from inexpensive hacks to elegant and usual pricey gadgets. My goal is to provide you with feasible options at every price point. Hopefully, you'll find something that works for you. How to read this book. One of the most delightful things about building a do-it-yourself camper van is imagining possibilities. For me, the hours that I spent researching, brainstorming, and planning my van were pure joy. I like discovering new products that I'd never seen before, and I loved figuring out how to use items in unique ways. I scored the internet for innovative ideas, made lists upon lists of possible solutions to common challenges, and weighed all of the pros and the cons. This book is the result of all of that research. I figured that if I needed all of that information, people just like you must need it too. So what I've created for you is essentially a huge list of ideas. Each chapter addresses one topic, and the concepts are listed in order of simplicity with the most simple concepts addressed toward the beginning of each chapter. In contrast to some other Van Dwelling books, I don't provide you with just one solution to a challenge. I offer you several possibilities covering a wide range of price points. I wholeheartedly encourage you to steal these ideas and tweak them to fit your needs. Please feel free to skip around and discover the book in a way that feels natural to you. For example, if toilets are one of your primary concerns, it was definitely one of mine, by all means read that section first. Before you dive in, there are a couple of notes that I'd like to mention. I have provided ballpark prices for your convenience, but please remember that prices vary from retailer to retailer and may change after this book is published. In conducting research for building my van and for writing this book, I unearthed several blog posts that demonstrate how other nomads use various products and solutions. I have provided links to these sources so that you may learn more from these examples. Please note that I have no control over the content that they publish and that if you visit those links, it is at your own risk. For more information on van dwelling basics as described by Chris Ahn, click the link in the description below this video.